My turn is gonna be all the way to the bottom floor. Okay, good. To my office. Who's this guy? Hey, Jensen. Glad to see you. Damn it. Now I sound like his girlfriend or something. Let's see what's on here. Turrets. Doors. I can turn off all the cameras. I guess if I knock anybody out, they won't see it on camera. Maybe. Oh, this is level three. Oh crap. I'll have to come back for that. Hey, Jensen. Man, it's good to see you. I'm glad you're back. How are you holding up? I manage. I'm sorry about Megan. I know it must be hard. For a while, we thought you were a goner too. Everything's going to shit. The attack on HQ, and now this mess with the factory. Yeah, tough times all around. How about you, Corella? You okay? I don't know. I, uh, I fucked up. I mean, bad. What happened? Well, a couple of months ago, me and Tyndall, you know, one of Pritchard's techs, we started sneaking out some neuropazine from one of the labs. Jesus, Tim. You realize this could get you fired, worse, arrested, if the company chooses to prosecute. What were you thinking? I know, it's just, it's complicated. I didn't want to do it at first, but there were good reasons. Anyway, now I want out, but Tyndall has security footage of me stealing the stuff and says he'll expose me if I ever stop helping him. I'm in a bad spot, Adam. I need that footage back. I know you're busy with everything that's going on right now, but I could really use your help. All right, tell me more. Really? Wow, thanks, Adam. I thought I was done for. The security footage will probably be on his apartment computer. Meet me in front of the subway station parking lot once you get a hold of it. I got it from here. So there are a lot of actual um, side quests, which is another awesome thing about this game. So I'm going to go ahead and do these as well. Okay, so I gotta find this guy's office. Finish quest. Not sure where that's. Oh, okay. I see. Um, so let's go. First, I'll try to do the side quest. I'm not sure if I need anything extra right now to do it, but we'll find out as we go. Did I take a long way again? How do I keep doing that? Now I can go outside. Who this? Nice job tonight, Adam. I heard most of those vandals got arrested peacefully. Things could have been so much worse. Thank you. Okay, am I retarded or what? Why can I not go outside? Oh. <laughs> Gotta actually open the door, guys. Mrs. Reed? Another oh, side quest. Adam, I'm sorry you startled me. And please, call me Cassandra. You and Megan were together long enough. I was waiting for you. Out here? Why not come meet me inside? I don't know. I guess I'm just not ready. This is where you work. But to me, this is also the place where I lost my daughter. Oh. I guess I never thought of it that way. I'm sorry. It's not proper of me to come here and stir up bad memories, especially after what you've been through. Yeah. A lot of things changed six months ago. I can't get over how much they've changed you. At first, I couldn't even believe you were still alive. How do you handle all of this? They did what they had to do to save me. And in a way, I can do more now than I ever could. I'm glad to know you take it so well. 
many of us wouldn't be able to cope so easily with such dramatic changes. Can I ask why you wanted to see me? Yes, of course. I'm sorry. I'm here about Megan. About what happened to her. Or rather, about the investigation into what happened. What about it? Well, simply put, I feel something is not quite right with the way the case was handled. You think there was some foul play involved? I do. Call it mother's intuition. But when speaking to some of the investigators, there were a lot of inconsistencies. And then I met this detective, a man called Chase. He agreed things weren't handled by the book, although he has no proof. And now you want to find out more? I'll never hear my daughter laugh again, Adam. I'll never get a call from her to ask how I've been, or have the chance to ask her about her day. She was stolen from me. However unjustified this all is, I still want to know why it happened. You're not the same, Adam. And we've yet to see if it's for better or worse. But I know you loved Megan. Please, will you help me find out what really happened to her? Of course I will. I never got a chance to investigate the attack myself. I'll look into it. Thank you. This means the world to me, Adam. Really. The first thing I'll need to do is meet with this detective, Chase. Good. He works part-time as a security guard in an apartment building on Brooklyn Court. I'll be waiting for you in your apartment lobby once you're done. Why does a detective need to work part-time as a security guard? Oh, he retired soon after the case. I don't really know the details. Maybe he'll tell you more. I'm on it. Sorry guys, give me a second.
Sorry about that, guys. Okay, um, let's go. Uh, that's a chick. She just said stuff to me. Have you found anything? Please. I've got to know 